Today I'm going to show you how to use the site plugin to better understand how a scientific article has been cited uh, and more specifically to see if it has been supported or disputed by subsequent research. So to show you this example I'll show you my actual research. So there I am. Uh, this was published in eLife. I was looking at chromosome segregation defects in human cells. I did my PhD at Virginia Tech. We collaborated with the hospital in Portugal as well as the lab at the NIH. It's been cited 43 times and then viewed roughly 6,600 times. And so behind these 43 studies or reviews are directly related work by definition. Maybe some of them have looked at a similar claim uh, to the one that I make in this paper, and maybe some of them have supported it or disputed it. And so in today's world, you can click through the citation number, and you can select a citation index for like Scopus, Crossref, PubMed Central, uh, Web of Science, or, or Dimensions.ai as well. And if you click through this, you will generally see a list of titles. And so here you can see what are the different articles saying uh, about this work, uh, but you can't uh, see the context. So in order to see what this article says about my article, you'll need to open up all these different articles to see this. And so using Cite, we've actually done a lot of machine learning to make this easier to see how a citation has been used by showing the citation context. Um, and we have released this browser extension from for Chrome uh, or Firefox that will show you the site information anywhere you're reading a scientific article online. So if you click this, it brings you over to site, and you can see that we have the same basic metadata as the journal, so the, or as, as the journal, so you see the title, uh, the DOI, the authors, uh, and then a link to the version of record, as well as the abstract. And then we show the citations, very similar to other citation indices, uh, but very different in that we show the context of the citation. So this excerpt of text comes from this full text article uh, and you can very quickly read what is this article saying about the article of interest. We've broken down these citation statements in context into do they provide supporting evidence, disputing evidence, or just mentioning evidence. And so in my case you can see that I've received two different supporting citations. This first one says in agreement with previous work and then there's citation on Nicholson et al. The trisomic clone shows similar aberrations, albeit to a lesser extent. Uh, and then the second one uh, says, as shown in figure 2E and F, RPE plus 18 cells displayed a significant increase in chromosome segregation rates consistent with the results of our live cell imaging analysis. Um, next to each of these, we show the confidence that the model has in making these classifications. Uh, and so this one's uh, a lot more clear than the second one, uh, but both are, are clear to the reader. Um, and then beyond just providing, supporting, and, and disputing classifications, we also allow people to search these. And so say you are interested in chromosome segregation uh, defects, but you wanted to look in yeast. So you could search citation contexts uh, and, and find relevant citations that are, are co-cited or uh, that are, are mentioned in the, the citing article. In addition to this, and finally, we allow you to organize the citation statements by where they appear in the paper. So do you want to look at articles that cite my work uh, that come from the methods section? Maybe there's some key differences between different papers and how they did their work. Uh, or do you want to see how my work has been discussed by others? Uh, this will allow you to quickly uh, break down where citations uh, are coming from. And so this is you know, a quick and easy way to gain a lot of valuable information uh, anywhere you're reading a scientific article online. Uh, it's free to use the plugin, which is again available for Firefox uh, or Chrome. Uh, and should work on, on nearly all uh, publisher websites that you're browsing. Thanks.